DNS crank. So once the fish bite, look, it got his lip pretty much locked right here. So it can be a bass, it can be a salmon, a sea trout, a muskie, a pike, a walleye. When he's on, he's on. It's almost impossible to lose that fish thanks to that. So this is your typical retrieve. I will say probably, probably 90% of the time, this is the speed you're going to use when you're gonna crank that DNS. So now, a very important thing is the way you set the hook. Do that long sweep, allows to the hook the time to go up and hook the fish mouth. I got this big bass on the DNS crank. That's a trophy fish. And right here in Florida, we have a conservation program that is made to encourage the catch and release of big fish and to bring data to FWC. So for that, we need a few things. We need a tape, we can measure the length, we can measure the girth, weighting the fish with a scale, which I encourage to have IGFA certified, it's pretty cheap, and a device to hold the fish to weight it. So let's measure and weight that fish and see if it can be part of that program. It's always a sweet moment to catch that fish. And believe me, it's always even a sweetest moment when you release that fish. That's where fishing for sport makes so much sense.